Why is spinning acceleration? I don't, I'm not sure that would be clear to everyone. It's sure. Certain. So, yeah, I mean, there are two kinds of acceleration intuitively, the way you learn this initially. One is like when you're stopped at a stoplight and you put your foot on the gas and you feel pushed back in the car because, as you would say, you, you're going faster and faster. So an acceleration is a change in your velocity. And your velocity intuitively can change in two quite different ways. You can keep going in the same direction, but faster or slower. That's the kind of acceleration that pushes you forward and back in the car. Or you can keep the same speed, but change your direction. When you're spinning a uniform circular motion, your velocity, your speed isn't changing as it were, but your velocity is because the velocity includes the direction. And so th this was Newton's key to coming up with his gravitational theory. I mean, this is the whole story about the apple and everything else. Newton says, wait, the moon, for example, is going around the earth, right? It's orbiting. And the earth is orbiting the sun. Those are accelerations because they're constantly changing their direction. By F equals MA, there's an A, this is an acceleration, there has to be a force. And for uniform circular motion, the force has to be a centripetal force. It, it has to be directed toward the center. So there must be a force that's keeping the moon in orbit. There must be a force that's keeping the Earth-Moon system in orbit around the sun.